what's up everybody welcome to another camera comparison video today i have this vivo x60 pro plus honor magic 3 pro plus and iphone 12 pro max yeah i think iphone 12 pro max is doing better look at that look at the sky look at the background anyway check carefully which smartphone has rendered my skin tone correctly which smartphone rendered the colors correctly which smartphone microphone is working better check these carefully and make a comment in the comment section below well i need to mention that i had to buy all these smartphones none of these brands have sent me any review units so i wish that you appreciate my hard work i had to pay a lot of money to buy these smartphones if you end up liking this video if you find this video helpful then please don't forget to click on the like button and please subscribe to this channel well it's time to start our camera comparison video when you feel it's hopeless when you think Let's jump right into the night mood photos. Usually I put night mood photos at the end but here I am doing it differently because first I want to share some differences with you. They all do very well in low light but Vivo X60 Pro Plus and Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus have bigger sensors so this should be interesting. Also depending on a few taps and clicks, Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus can perform a bit better than the other two. All of these smartphones have very good focus metering and subjects get detected very fast. But Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus will perform better if you manually tap on the subject. It will have better focus metering, better noise removal with that desired level of sharpness. Also Magic 3 Pro Plus white balance in night mode is totally different than daytime photos. It has cold color temperature while both the iPhone and Vivo tries to create a punchier more contrasty effect with warm tone and increased contrast. Surprisingly, iPhone 12 Pro Max have managed to produce the brightest pictures among these three. And actually what surprises me is, even with a 12 megapixel sensor, iPhone 12 Pro Max has managed to get enough details, but as mentioned earlier, having a larger sensor actually helped X60 Pro Plus and Magic 3 Pro Plus. Both of these have more details and exposure is also better than iPhone 12 Pro Max. Some people may argue, look at the photos grabbed by iPhone 12 Pro Max. Those are brighter, punchier and eye-pleasing. I really respect your comments and I know we all have our own preferences and we always try to get what we expect. But let's do some pixel peeping and check which of the three actually can pass my test. D-E-N-S, Details, Exposure, Noise and Shadow. Yes, Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus have better noise reduction but that sacrifices some details. Vivo X60 Pro Plus have the best exposure but color rendition isn't that great. iPhone 12 Pro Max have a balance between details and noise. Shadows are almost similar on all three but certainly Vivo X60 Pro Plus has done better with slightly better shadow details. Yes, iPhone 12 Pro Max is very close and definitely Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus deserves enough praise cause if you can manually select the subject then this one is actually the best. All of these photos were taken on auto mode and all the pictures that you are going to see are straight out of the camera with no edits. So this is exactly what you can expect if you buy any of these smartphones. Yeah, AI and scene detection or scene optimizer whatever you call it was disabled, HDR was set to auto. Anyway, color is going to be very subjective, everyone has a different preference and when it comes to sky color rendition, I have noticed Vivo X60 Pro Plus to be more accurate. However, there is a color cast on Vivo X60 Pro Plus photos which I really don't like. Both iPhone and Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus added some synthetic processing and produced photos which are more pleasing to the eye. I have also noticed Auto HDR is very inconsistent on Vivo and iPhone while Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus has consistently managed to get better and wider dynamic range without highlight clipping. Check details, texture processing, sky color, white balance of Magic 3 Pro Plus. It is way better than Vivo X60 Pro Plus and in some extent it is even better than iPhone 12 Pro Max. But sometimes it awfully increases highlights and shadows get crushed. If we are looking for natural true to life color rendition then none of these three can actually provide that but Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus seems better than the other two. 
I was surprised when I have first started taking photos of human subject with Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus cause it's totally different than Honor Magic 3 Pro. High contrast, high saturation, better skin tone, less details, poor exposure and soft textures. This is a mixed experience. It's actually almost the same on Vivo X60 Pro Plus but in a different way. Better exposure with added skin fairness, better color rendition, almost perfectly processed textures, very well balanced mid-tones and saturation but dynamic range isn't that great. Beside these two, iPhone 12 Pro Max definitely looks different but this one also has its own issues. Poor contrast, increased highlights, saturation and warm color temperature. I don't know about you but this isn't exactly what I was expecting. Based on personal preferences, I would like Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus but the model FIA likes the photos of Vivo X60 Pro Plus. Okay, now we have to check ultra wide photos and I am super hyped about the ultra wide mood. Why? Cause Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus got a 64 megapixel sensor and Vivo X60 Pro Plus got a gimbal stabilized 48 megapixel sensor and iPhone 12 Pro Max got a 12 megapixel sensor without any stabilization. Put all the hypes aside, all of these three actually performed pretty similarly and yes, performance is great. Very good dynamic range and details, good balance between texture sharpness, highlights and contrast. I have no complaint about the quality. But there are some preferential differences. Vivo X60 Pro Plus saturates the colors, grabs a lot of details. Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus concentrates on reproducing natural true to life photos. iPhone 12 Pro Max balances between processing, sharpness and shadows. You will not feel bad with any of these until and unless you like to do some pixel peeping. Both the Vivo X60 Pro Plus and Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus have great zoom capabilities. There are two differentiating factors. First one is the lens and the second one is the size of sensor and pixel count. All of these three smartphones telephoto sensors have optical image stabilization. I'm very surprised to see how good the 5x zoom is on the Magic 3 Pro Plus. It is very comparable to the Mi 11 Ultra. And iPhone 12 Pro Max actually heavily depends on digital cropping on anything beyond 2.5x zoom. Yes, Magic 3 Pro Plus does pick up more detail and textures are very sharp. Exposure is certainly better on iPhone 12 Pro Max but highlight and ambience is better on Vivo X60 Pro Plus. In my opinion, Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus looks the best with better color, better white balance and details. I also need to mention that Vivo X60 Pro Plus also have another 32 megapixel sensor tagged to a 2x optical zoom lens which gives it more versatility. This is a segment where iPhone 12 Pro Max should win cause it has a dedicated 2.5x telephoto lens. But wait, Vivo X60 Pro Plus also got a 2x telephoto lens. Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus actually takes portrait photos with the main sensor and then applies 2x digital cropping. Yes, there is some type of beauty effect on all three but iPhone 12 Pro Max has applied heavy beauty effect which you may find surprising but these days it's a trend on all the new iPhones. General attributes are the same as those of the main sensor human subject photos. Bokeh effect is almost similar on Vivo and Honor but iPhone 12 Pro Max bokeh is a bit heavier. Subject and background separation is also slightly drastic on iPhone 12 Pro Max. Edge detection and edge cutouts are equally good on all of the smartphones. But Vivo X60 Pro Plus is ahead of the other two. This segment is actually the most important part cause these days most of the average flagship smartphones can perform good under bright daylight but fails to perform in indoor low light environment. Once again, very difficult to judge. White balance is a bit warm on iPhone. Vivo X60 Pro Plus has brighter image with better exposure and better color rendition. Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus has sometimes saturated the colors and sometimes processed tonal contrast without any accuracy. 
iPhone 12 Pro Max has its own unique color grading. Truly, to me, Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus proved to be better. It may not be significantly better than the other two, but it has that consistency. In terms of color rendition, sharpness and details, Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus is slightly ahead and as usual, color grading on all of these smartphones are inconsistent. And sometimes Magic 3 Pro Plus follows Vivo X60 Pro Plus. Sometimes iPhone 12 Pro Max has lost a lot of details. As I always say, a lot depends on personal preferences. Cause many of my friends liked the photos taken by iPhone 12 Pro Max cause it has that vibrance. It gives them a feeling that they have grabbed the perfect photo. But I personally like the photos which represents reality. When you feel it's hopeless, when you think that you lost, oh, well, we need to check the selfie photos and the differences are extremely heavy. iPhone 12 Pro Max made my skin tone much darker than it is. Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus has better color rendition, but skin tone is a bit fair than usual. Vivo X60 Pro Plus almost got colors and skin tone correct, but with high mid-tones and exposure, it also doesn't portray reality. Oh yes, iPhone 12 Pro Max saturated the colors crazily. Even if you bash me, I cannot like iPhone selfies. Okay, these are selfie portraits. If you don't know yet, then there is an international smartphone giveaway going on. I will give away a Huawei P50 Pro and a OnePlus 9R to two of my active subscribers. To join giveaway, what you have to do is to check these portrait photos and make a comment describing which one did better. I will pick a winner based on valid and descriptive comment. All of these smartphones can record videos in 4K 30 frames per second and offers super sharp, super crisp 4K videos while Vivo X60 Pro Plus can record videos in 8K. It is not that surprising to see that Vivo X60 Pro Plus has better exposure and dynamic range. Details and textures are almost similar, but iPhone 12 Pro Max has continued to process with saturation and warm color temperature. Yeah, colors are subjective, colors are down to personal preference. Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus beside these two seems to have better stabilization Let's check these clips carefully and you will find something interesting. Well, it's time for verdict and I think considering the price, Vivo X60 Pro Plus is the winner. But if you put the price away and check performance, Honor Magic 3 Pro Plus is slightly ahead. What's your thoughts and ideas about these? Please let me know in the comment section. Also, if you have liked this video, then please click on the like button and subscribe to this channel.